A former South African opposition leader has condemned President Cyril Ramaphosa's endorsement of President Emerson Nangakwa's re-election in Zimbabwe. Musi Maimani, a former leader of the Democratic Alliance, South Africa's biggest opposition party, said Ramaphosa's endorsement of President Mnangagwa's re-election under controversial circumstances is a betrayal to both the people of South Africa and the Southern African Development Community, Sark region. In a video he posted on microblogging site X, Mr. Maimani said, South Africa would continue to grapple with migration from Zimbabwe for as long as the situation in Zimbabwe is not addressed. Fellow South Africans, it is now common cause, according to the SADC Observer Mission, that the elections in Zimbabwe were a complete sham. The elections could not meet the threshold of being considered free and fair. Essentially, these elections have now elected Emerson Monangawa as president under very dubious conditions. What it concerns us as South Africans is that President Ramaphosa is attending this, in my opinion, illegally elected president's inauguration. This is a betrayal of the people of this country. It is a betrayal of SADC, and more seriously, it undermines our stance in Africa for a country that wants to secure democracy. Let me highlight why this is such an important issue. Because actually the issues in Zimbabwe are issues in South Africa. When there's water that flows into your house because of a tap, that, a tap that's outside, you don't start off by mopping out the water. You actually go out and close the tap. We have to uphold the sovereignty and the democratic practice in Zimbabwe if we are going to deal with the influx of immigrants coming from Zimbabwe into South Africa. Secondly, we should observe the SADC Observer Mission. It is true today that three out of the 53 presidents in Africa, only three attended that inauguration. Only three from SADC have attended, which tells me that other leaders have a spine and a courage to say they will not stand up for rigged elections. Yet our president went through. So the message is simple. If the ANC cannot be trusted to fight for democracy in Zimbabwe, how can it be trusted to fight and maintain democracy here in South Africa? Let this be a salient warning to all of us. We need to lead on democracy and we need to hold the ANC to account, to account on this issue. And it is completely wrong that President Ramaphosa is endorsing Emerson Munangaba.